y'all it's your girl Hermela Sean I'm here back with another video of course you gonna call me I <clears throat> like I was saying but I was really interrupted by that beautiful man hey y'all it's your girl Hermela Sean and I'm here back with another video period <laughs> get into this video y'all make sure y'all like comment subscribe because why would you not want to be a part of my channel like uh, today's i can tell you that i'll be giving y'all 10 10 10 10 x that i have in a relationship i don't know how i forgot this but y'all this is a whole collab like that's <laughs> Man, <shit show. laughs> this is a whole freaking collab y'all make sure y'all go watch life with Kalia. life with clear y'all make sure y'all compare like do we have any x that's like the same or similar or what but y'all this is the whole collab y'all don't see how i forgot to mention her channel in the video but this is a whole collab make sure y'all go watch her video make sure y'all get her to a thousand subscribers because baby she really almost there she had like 700 she really she really almost there y'all can get her to look that look cool little 300 you know make sure y'all go watch all her video please y'all she dropping very consistently too like for the past week over there, i don't know what's going on she might be in that mode come for the past week baby she been dropping like this like i love y'all mm. so my first ick is when boys treat kids badly like and the reason i put this as the ick because the complete opposite is what i like like if you know how to take care of kids, no, like if you if you patient with kids, like just I don't know, kids is just like that's a non-sexual turn on. Like that's just like you taking care of kids, you doing stuff for kids. Like 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 let's for let's say for example your nieces and nephews. I'm not talking about you, but let's just say for example your nieces and nephews. Like if you caring about them, being patient with them, just doing everything that you supposed to do as a dad or whatever. Like that's just an nonsense you turn on. So that's why I put it as the ink. Because I can't stand when people like treat kids so bad. Like, I understand kids can be bad sometimes. And I don't mean like you yell at them one time and then ill. No, I mean just like, I don't know, just talking down on kids, like, I don't know, just treating them badly. Like being rude to them for no reason. Like I hate that. Like that's just the ick. Like that don't make me wanna just not talk being lovey dovey too soon when i tell you i hate i freaking hate i hate when boys so straightforward with stuff like i just like of course like i ain't gonna say straightforward because like i didn't know what you want but like i just don't like that um that what's up man you cute you beautiful you this and that too soon like a nigga try to talk to me or like like in the hallway some nigga try to talk to me be like oh you fine you bad you look good this and that i don't like shit like that like the only like i swear i kid you not for me to actually get to know you and want to actually talk to you you gonna have to treat me like like i'm game like i can't stand i can't stand that um that um coming out like i look uh, you look good in my heart eyes i love you more like i can't stand shit like that make me like ill for you to actually get a taste back out of me you gonna have to not let me know that you want me like you gonna have to come up like what's up twin what's up cuz like something like that and then like after we get talking or whatever then you could be like oh yeah i know this you you know you look good start with the compliment slowly but don't just you gotta be kind of like you gotta go gradually in it like you can't just because i'm gonna be like uh no, I don't know nothing about that corny nickname. Oh, that's my princess. You look so good, sweetheart. Oh, if you don't get I would make you so mad because I literally laugh in your face. That shit, that junk. Oh, let me stop kissing. That junk is so corny. Like, I don't like that. Like, that'll make me be off you so quick because my nigga, what? Princess, I'll mock you all day for calling me that shit. Like, fourth eight, joking about insecurities. Y'all. The joking about insecurity, like, I used to have so many, like, I still have insecurity, don't get me wrong, but, like, it used to be, I used to have so many insecurities, and they, like, that's all they used to do, just joke about it, joke about it, joke about it. This is a big ick. Letting me run over you slash too nice. I ain't gonna set my mouth disrespectful, but if I'm in a relationship with you, I'm gonna try you a lot. You're letting me walk over you, and I'm the female, like, if you're not being a man, then, and I can walk all over you, why would I submit to you? If I know I can walk all over you, why would I submit to you? Not too laid back and too nonchalant. I don't like nonchalant and laid back ass niggas like, because what you mean I tell you, um, 
I'm finna go out with my girls. And you be like, okay. You gonna ask me where I'm going, um, um, who you going with, like, not trying to be controlling, but like, I, me personally, I don't want my man to ask me, cause it make it seem like he actually give, he actually care. Like, I don't know, I just don't like laid back slash not smart ass niggas. The next one is controlling. I can't stand a controlling, a controlling nigga. Like, I've heard some stories from, you know, some people where their boyfriend don't let them go out, their boyfriend don't let them hang out with friends. Their boyfriend made them cut all their friends off. Or, like, I done heard some stories like that. And it's like, I'm not judging you because that's your relationship. Do what you do. Go ahead. Whatever works for y'all, works for y'all. But I'm not picking up what y'all putting down. Like, I can't be in a relationship with nobody who don't let me have fun. Because, like, the only time I can go out is when I'm with you. Like, what? you don't trust me to go to the store by myself? I can't go to the gas station and give me some gas without you? I can't spend no control on nigga. Body shaming. Another ick with body shaming, like, I don't care, I don't care if you body shaming me, body shaming, um, the girl next to us, I don't care if you body shaming the girl on TV, don't, but I hate that, like, and I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna say my boyfriend body shaming females, but, like, he'll, he might, he might make a comment, y'all know, like, like, I don't know where y'all, y'all boyfriends are, like, say something that remind you that they still a nigga, he'll comment or something, and I, like, tell him, like, don't say that, it's rude, it's mean, what if I look like that and, like, a two years or not like you you say you call her big okay what if i get big in two years what if i have a a health problem and that caused me to get big like you know what i'm saying so i don't like that another one bad hygiene of course that's the most biggest like that's that's the most common ick like bad hygiene like just i don't like bad hygiene like i understand people go through phases and stuff because like well at the age we are now it's kind of like okay Y'all, you should have already went through your face by now. And I ain't talking about just like one bad day. Because I know some people might have their little bad days or whatever. Like, you know, everybody not finna just look and smell good, perfect all the time. So, like, I understand that. But, like, the constantly, like, like three, four, five days back to back, you you got something going on. And you not, and it's not a health problem. Let's, let's, let's go on. Put me on mute while I peep in the room. I hate that. I do that too. But like, if y'all homeboys and y'all talking about something, and then you put me on mute, why y'all in the room? That would get, make me go from zero to hundred real quick. Cause what did y'all talk about? Because y'all know like, y'all know like us overthinkers or whatever. If you don't give us a conclusion, we gonna make up our own conclusion no matter how delusional it is. So even if y'all wasn't even talking about me, if you put me on mute while y'all homeboys in the room, I'll be like. So, especially, like, dead in the middle of a conversation. Because it's, like, y'all talking back and forth, chin chat, chin chat, and boom. And all I hear is, eh, da, 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 boom. So, it's, like, what was he finna say that made you want to put me on mute? My last ick out of all of them, being too sensitive. And that kind of goes back to the letting me run over you slash being too nice. I talk mess. I don't, don't want to cuss, but I talk mess. Like, I'm going to try you and all that. So, if you being sensitive and just let me walk over you, that's just going to be irritating because, like, I got a sleek mouth. So, it's like, so if you're not going to talk that mess back or if you're not going to check me, choke me, do something about it, then what what is being in a relationship for? But that was my last ick, y'all. Thank y'all for watching this video. Thank y'all. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, turn on post on the case. I'll be notified every time I'm like, sure I post another video. And thank y'all for watching. And um, we on the road to 400 subscribers. Let's see, can we get there by the end of March? Bye, y'all. I love y'all. And make sure y'all have a good day. Make sure y'all pray if y'all haven't already. Mm -hmm.